so as promised i'm gonna do the video about the engagement ceremony and explaining to you guys how it works for us Sikhs. Um, please, I just want to kind of put a message out to everyone as well that I'm going to try my best to explain this to you in simple terms um, and make it as easy as possible. Um, there is a difference in, in the way that the, you know, um, Umrat Dali Sikhs and the non Umrat Dali Sikhs do certain traditions. So I'm not by all means saying anything to them or, you know, saying that they're doing things wrong because, you know, at the end of the day, things are done differently according to Red Mariada and according to Sikhs that are not baptised. Um, so th there will be a difference in some of the things that I'm going to explain to you guys. I also want to put out to you guys as well that I, I don't personally believe in the caste system. Um, however, a lot of people do. And I'm not going to dispute that because that's their own personal choices. Um, however, some of the information that I will give you may differ and may vary because some people, like I said, if you're into the caste system and you believe that strongly and um, that's the way you guys are, then, you know, some of you will have different um, different different ways of doing things and um, different customs and this may not even apply to some of the stuff that I'm saying but overall as Sikhs I'm just going to explain to you what the standard ceremonies are um, and I'm sure a lot of you guys do it the same um, but obviously you may have a few things different the way you, you, you might do certain things differently so um, I just wanted to clarify these two things before I start. <laughs> all out of the way we'll um start on and talk about um the ceremonies and um how it basically flows so um the first thing is a rukka so some of you may call it a taka um this is the pre-engagement ceremony so you know just your mom and dad your siblings and you know your partners mom and dad and their siblings will kind of sit down together first and kind of get to know each other and make a decision of right okay you know we're happy the kids are happy let's Let's take this to the next step. So they'll probably give you guys a bit of sugar, you know, like ten pound, a bit of ladoo, a bit of chocolate, whatever you guys fancy, you know, and just kind of say, right, okay, this is this is gonna go ahead now. Um, I think we're we're both happy, we're mutual, we 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 know each other. Let's take it to the next stage. Right. So the next part is the gurmai and the chunni. So this is kind of classed as your engagement, right? So this is the stage where, you know, you'll have a Gurmai program, possibly at the Gurdwara first, um, where a lot of the men will kind of go there, sing the Gurum Gurmai Aya, and that will be done. Um, and then once that's done, that kind of says that, you know, okay, he's ours now. You know, second stage, they are again, we're on the second stage for the wedding. Um, and we kind of, we're here to kind of give our blessing to the boy and say, right, you know, we're happy with everything and, you know, you're ours now. And then give him gifts and, you know, they give money during this time okay, as well. And now we're going to talk about the Junni. So in the Junni, it's basically um, done, either you can do it at home, you guys can do it in a hall. Um, and when it's done at a venue, the boy side will give the girl um, clothes to wear, so an outfit. Um, she'll put the outfit on, come down and she'll sit down on the stage kind of in front of everyone. Um, and then what they would do is all the women of the household, all the close women, they would then go up and they would put some makeup on her. Obviously, she'll have her hair and makeup done anyway. They just do southern. So they'll just kind of pretend to put mascara on and, you know, put a bindi on and put a bit of lipstick, um, paint your nails, put a bit of mendi in the middle of your hand. So that's just southern, that is. They'll give you some jewellery, could be artificial, could be real gold. Um, again, they'll give you the sukkah meva as well, um, which is the sorghi, badam and everything like I explained. They'll also give you some money as as well. And then that's kind of basically it. You know, you guys can exchange rings at that point. Exchange of your rings is done. Um, you're basically engaged. So everybody will congratulate you guys. Um, and then you guys can have an engagement dance. You guys can just chill and party and, you know, mingle with family and friends, which is the ideal thing to do. Um, mingle with your family and friends, um, introduce each other to, you know, your family and stuff and basically enjoy the rest of the evening because that's now your engagement done. You know, it's official. You guys are getting married. So the, the Rukka and the Taka explain to immediate members of family that there is a Rishta and, it, you know, it's happening. There's proceedings going on. Um, and then the engagement, which is the Junni and the Gurmai ceremony, kind of put the stamp on it to say, right, you know, this is going to happen. It's, it's going ahead. It's all bakka. Everything's done. Um, and then the next stage is actually the wedding day, um, which, again, I can talk about if you guys request. 
Um, so let me know, guys, what you think. I it, you know, the best I can in such short amount of time because you don't realise, you know, when you're just blabbering on, like, the video just literally, like, takes up so much time. So I've explained it as quick as I can. I can explain it in detail. Um, if you guys wanted, I can do, like, um, a, a post. I can write it all up and I can do a post and kind of explain it and just leave it on the story feed. Um, and you guys can, you know drop in and just check on that and have a look and read back if you wanted to or you guys can share it to other family friends as well um you, like i said the video is not long enough and um, you don't have long enough time to kind of incorporate everything in there but i've just outlined and highlighted some of the things that do go down but if you guys want like more in depth and um, you want to ask me um please feel free just drop me a dm let me know what you want to know um and i will obviously let you guys know as, as much as i know myself mm -hmm.